Hi, I'm Evan Reese. I'm part of the editorial team here at Stratfor, and I'm here to talk to you today about a list of holiday recommendations. It's a collection of books, films, and video games that we've all found significant and that we thought were interesting for our users to check out as well. So for today, I'm just going to go through three books that I personally would highly recommend uh, and that have had a big impact on the way that I see the world and the way that I view geopolitics. The first of these is Bloodlands by Timothy Snyder, who's a Yale professor. His book Bloodlands focuses on a section of Central and Eastern Europe that was caught between fascist Berlin and Soviet Moscow uh, between uh, 1932 and 1945. And he talks about the 14 million people that were killed there, but he sees it through a new angle. He gets very, very nitty gritty about the details and exactly how these schemes played out. And he takes us beyond the banality of evil to give you the rationality of evil, the clear political calculations that were behind these extremely horrifying acts and a time that will resonate long, long into the future. Bloodlands is excellent. It's a, it's a bit of a slog to get through the whole thing. It's very long, but it's quite a good book and I, it changed my way of thinking. The next book I want to talk about is, it's called The Cold War, A New History by John Lewis Gaddis. Gaddis is called the Dean of Cold War History. He's very, very deep in the subject. He's written about it for years as a historian. Uh, and he's a professor at Yale. He wrote a very clear, succinct book that's not simplistic enough to be a primer, but it's comprehensive enough to give you a picture of the whole conflict in well under 300 pages. It's a great look at what the Cold War did to remake the world. And then you can bring that forward to think about the post-Cold War world. And then you can bring that forward again to think about what Stratfor writes about a lot, which is the post-post-Cold War world. So I highly recommend it, very readable. The last book I wanna talk about is called Illicit by Moises Naim. It's a book about illegal trade, essentially. And that covers everything from narco trafficking, human trafficking, to simple bootlegging. He makes the point that the way that we think about trying to combat these sorts of illicit activities is extremely antiquated, and that we don't fully understand the impact that globalization, digitization, and containerization have had on illicit trade patterns. He talks about how, for example, a lot of illicit activities, including methamphetamine manufacture and, you know, something like bootlegging, use the same sorts of factory facilities that legal trade does. He talks about how a lot of the smuggling networks involve a number of people who aren't truly criminals, they're technically criminals, but people who work relatively white collar above board jobs. It's an awesome book, very readable, and with a lot of fascinating little case studies into bizarre corners of the criminal underground. Thanks for watching today. Check out our list of 20 items and recommendations for the new year. I know that I will, and I'm going to dig into a lot of them going into the holiday season and going into 2017. Thank you.